What is happening, guys? Cowboy here. Welcome back to a new week as we work our way towards the end of Red Dead Redemption 2. I'd worked my way back to camp, and as soon as I got there, Micah had to just spew trash out of his mouth. Figured it would be fun to pause and listen to the garbage together. Weak and unfortunate. You're unfortunate. I don't like helping you. <laughs> just leave it, will you? Suit yourself. Chase him around and antagonize him. And he also brought a bunch of people back to camp. You can see just how far Dutch has gone. Comes up, talking all this trash. Morning, partner. What is it? Just say it. Got this guy. I don't know who that is. Why are you? Is this guy? By me? You need to watch it. Lucky that they won't let me pull a gun out in camp. Yo, keep. And we got. Nobody wants you here, partner. You got a big mouth, don't you? Can't you tell that? What's wrong with you? Are you too stupid? I won't warn you again. Are you as dumb as you look. Son of a bitch. The other one. Where he go? That. Is that him? John. Micah's little butt buddy go. What happened to you? Forster? Why did you have to go and change on me? What are you talking about? I never lied to you. I told you the truth. I gave you all I had. All of you! So Dutch is clearly losing it. I'm surprised I didn't get. I like that it's not letting me take up any of the options. It's question mark. Do oh, you have something? Hi there. Hey, Arthur. You want to talk? Talk, but why is there a little. I guess it just means that she has a quest that I could do. Um, so I want to work things towards a resolution. I mean, the seeing as now that we have... Uh, you know, now that, that I am a honorable lad. <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty much right on the middle, I think. That's, that's close. I'm going to need to make sure to basically just behave for the rest of this playthrough. If I'm going to get out of here. Another day. But let's make our way out. We'll get this mission done. This horse belongs. Yeah, I didn't want a stupid horse anyway. He's getting mine mixed up with Dutch's. Probably not gonna let me mount my horse here until I trail. Come on, a little bit more. Hey, little dude. You okay, Jack? Is Mr. Strauss gone? Yeah, he had to leave. Sorry. All right, now we can get on it. Morning. Get going. Away we go. All right. I'm not sure how much we have left, but I'd imagine we're. Uh, I know. I know we gotta be winding down. I mean, we we did Strauss's missions and it booted him on out of camp. Um. You know, we've already talked with John about when the time comes. Easy. Him deciding to, to leave and find his own way. And then we talked with Sadie about also leaving and going with him. And it sounded like somebody was being attacked over here. Yeah. See what this guy is. Maybe I can help him. Just go away, will you? I'm not talking to you because you won't talk to me. You won't, and it's not fair. How come? How come you get to make the choice and not me? 
Leave me alone, will you? This is exhausting. He's watching. He's always watching. Well, another person that I'm not getting the option to uh, read or antagonize. I feel like as we are working our way towards the end of the game, we're seeing a lot of kind of like forced plot or forced non-plot. I don't know if that's actually a, a term. Like, no, but you're going to just listen to what this person says and you're not going to decide to antagonize or whatever the case is. Anyway, we're going to see how much I can just kind of cut across. Because looking at the map, yeah, so it had me from the camp, it had me going and going all these trails. I'm going to bet that I could go north of Oak Craig's Run and pretty much cut a ton of time off of this run. As long as these mountains aren't too mountainous. I think Stella here can navigate just fine. Yeah. Keep trying to make basically a beeline for that point. Finally got Arthur's honor up. I can't feel my leg anymore. You have to get this trap off me, please. Kind of looks like Teddy Roosevelt. Mm. Keep pulling. I could. Keep... Oh God. Oh, oh, you did it. Oh, oh. I uh, I gotta get some scrap or, or something here. Oh, oh, Mister, you. I thought. I was gonna be oh god! Oh, I thought I was gonna be a god. Whiskey. Oh, you, you can take whatever you want from my pack for saving me. Oh. Here, this will help with the pain at least. Oh, oh, yeah. Uh, mm. Yeah, good boy points. Let's go, bro. Yeah. I mean, honestly, I don't really think I've been a bad cowboy for most of this playthrough. Like, there's been a couple times where, you know, in jest, I may have grabbed somebody with a rope and drug them behind my horse or... You know, there's been, been plenty okay. of people that I've, I've robbed from. I haven't been, like, a really bad guy, you know? Like, I've I've tried to do right in a lot of situations, and sometimes yep. things just got a little out of hand. Uh, but especially seeing what an absolute shitter Dutch has become. It honestly feels kind of good to embrace the redemption part of this game. Like, I mean, up until now, you know, Dutch has, he's pretty much always, everything that Dutch has done up until now has always been for the sake of the gang, you know, getting money for the gang, um, moving, finding new shelter for the gang, securing cooperation and, and business opportunities for the sake of the gang, but the whole, like, you know, base, oh, hang on is there a lantern I have? It's crafting. I thought there was a lantern. I'm just going to run straight, I guess. Um, but, you know, with, with his whole, um, you know, kind of forcing the Indians into this conflict as a way to get the feds yep. off of us. I mean, Dutch has never been shy about putting his own profit before someone else's. But at the same time, up until that, I feel like he never really threw someone completely under the bus. You know? 
he he would do whatever it took to to help the gang succeed. But oh shit, what the hell happened? What what happened, Stella? What did we did we trip on some? I mean, I can't see anything, so it wouldn't surprise me, but, um, you know, he, he would never, like, if it meant going into a village and murdering everybody in the village to get the gang food, Dutch would have found a different way to get food before murdering a village of innocents. And now, it very much is, he just doesn't care. He's just doing, you know, so... I don't know, I guess just blinded with this this goal. Yep. Blinded with this escape, and, and Micah's yep. literally playing him like a fucking fiddle. Yep. I mean, bringing strangers on into the camp. Everywhere you go, like, I mean, at this point, it's if Micah, if Micah doesn't betray the gang, I will honestly be incredibly surprised. Like, all the bets are on Micah being just the piece of shit that I think he is. And to just see yeah. Dutch just get manipulated by him, it's like, man. How far can you fall? Move. Anyway. Let's see. Where did my shortcut put me? Nice! Popped right on out here. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I don't know if that's any, any faster than running straight here. Maybe not, considering we're at like 12 minutes. But, you know, we got to... I have to discuss my thoughts. Helped a guy with a bear trap. Listen to a weird dude at a river. I think it was time well spent. But I don't know what happened with Stella tripping in the tunnel. That still confuses me a little bit. Anyway, back up in Wapiti. Hopefully this is the last Wapiti mission. Not because I don't like the Wapiti missions, but because, god damn, there's a long run to get up here. Yes, and we're gonna go rescue the sun. Oh, no, yeah, of course we are. That's right. Charles oh, asked us. Thank you for coming. Of course. The chief, he's, uh... He, he's very... Maybe you could speak to him? Yes, there's a lot of game. He's in his tent. Joe, I'll wait for you here. Rains fall trust in him. So I will, too. It amazes me how they got they got uh, fires in the tent. Hello? I feel like that would just create I mean, a lot of smoke, you know? <laughs> like, I get it, smoke rises, Mr. but Morgan. it doesn't seem like it's rising that much. I'm so glad you could make it. How are you? My son. My son is foolish, but he's still my son. I know your son. A little. He's very brave. Very angry. He's me. How is your father? He's dead a long time. He uh, lived a lot longer than was good for any of us. My son probably wishes the same to me. <laughs> I doubt that. I want peace. I need my people to be safe. All my life I've tried to bring peace. But I love my son. They'll hang him for treason. Treason. He is the chief son of a proud nation. How could he commit treason? People who have lied to my people for a hundred years or more, that's treason. Well. What should I do? I don't think there's much chance reasoning with Colonel Favor. No. And any chance we had, your friend, Mr. Vanderland, has ensured relations between us and the army are worse than any point in the last five years. I'm sure he means well. Dutch? No, he, matters no, he doesn't. Are complex than he understands. Me and Charles will try and rescue your son. No. Yes, yes. I ain't got much to lose, and you got... I'm doing this. Charles! Where are you? Come on, let's go. <laughs> it's right there. Top. Charles! Of course. Charles! This ain't sure how. I've been working on that. I think there's a way. Follow me. Break into the fort?
So, I've been scouting the fort. The army are patrolling all the main roads and bridges in and out, but if we can get the horses across the river, I found a route that should get us in fairly close. If we wait until late enough, there's a place we should be able to sneak in around the back. Okay, whatever you think. I trust you. No guns, just knives and arrows. If we start making a lot of noise, he'll be dead before we get close to him. Okay. I left two canoes down river, in case we need another way out of there. Okay, good. <coughs> <coughs> You know, this wouldn't have happened if it wasn't for Dutch. It ain't just on Dutch. We all went along with it. He saw Eagle Flies burn hot, and he fanned the flames. He's not helping that tribe, he's helping himself. You see that, or you wouldn't have gone to Rain's fall behind his back. I guess I just keep thinking. There must be a way to save the situation. To pull Dutch out of the place he's in. Well, uh... I like Rain's Fall. I don't know, Arthur. Rain's Fall is in a tough situation. And that's for Dutch. <sighs> I gotta try. I own that, at least. You feel that? There's rain on the wind. I know. Listen, Charles. If it goes bad in there, you get yourself out. You got more to lose. No. Come on. Don't start talking like that. Uh, I didn't tell you before, but... I saw a doctor. It's pretty bad. <laughs> well, it's gonna get worse. Oh, Arthur. Any day we can die, hmm? We're riding to break an Indian chief's son out of a cavalry fort. We could both die tonight. In a way... It is a gift to know. In a way, you were lucky. Sure don't feel like that. You still have time to make amends. The others, Hosea, Lenny, Sean, all them, they didn't. And what about the Calendar boys? Both killed trying to escape Blackwater? A more vicious pair of bastards than ever was. And that's all they ever were and will be. Maybe. You're lucky. You got the chance to... to do something better. My guess is maybe that's why you're here now. Either way, just keep your head strong. We're close now. Are you all right? Yeah, I think so. That current's strong. Up here. Follow me. Uh, you were right about the damn rain. Yeah, but might help us with sneaking in there. Yep, cover the sound. So Rainsfall told me there was some retaliation after the meeting with Colonel Favors. Some women were taken, elders beaten. Bastards. Yeah, this isn't gonna be nice. There it is. Waiting for nightfall? I think that'll cause a big ass commotion. All right. This should be fun. Let's get ourselves hidden and wait till it gets dark. Over here. I guess this is it. I guess it is. Let's keep quiet. Arthur Scoffing's gonna give him away. Way Main thing is that they don't hear us. Ready? Rifle, I guess just in case shit goes wrong. Patrol group. Hopefully we'll be in and out before they can come back around. Two guards up front. 
If you take one, I'll take the other. Nice and quiet. Good. Let's make our way around the back. Stay close to the wall. Nick of snakes. Okay, let's go. Good. Let's keep moving. You just gotta assassin screed your way up this wall, man. That's it. Wait. Two more. One in the tower, one on the ground. Same as before. You take one. Okay. Come on. Around the back. And we should probably make sure that lantern isn't gonna start a fire. To the left, we gotta kill. There's a guard coming. You deal with him. All right. When I try to take out the throwing knives, it's like, here's your bow. Careful. Two more. All right, let's go. Wait. I'll make sure the tower's clear. more out front. Go up the tower, see if you can cause the distraction. Try to put an arrow into the lantern above that stack of wood over there. Struggle. That was the lantern, right? Fire! We got a fire near the ammo! Let's go! Let's go! Arthur, come on! Get down here! For the keys. You have to get me out of here. We're gonna get you out. I'll check the table, Arthur. You search the body. 
Got him. Come on. <clears throat> Your father sent us. My father? He told you to come and kill guards? No, he didn't say that. He... Of course not. You okay? Sure. Enjoy being tortured. Clears the mind. If you say so. Huh, whoa, no. whoa. I'm fine, I'm fine. Oh. Damn it! I'll have to shoot our way out. You must be out of your mind. Let's push up! Get Maybe done. God will have mercy. Oh shit. Oh. Oh no, poor horse, yeah, I didn't mean it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I had someone ask him why I always, uh, why I go into this and then insist on, like, tabbing and looking around and marking people. And the fact is, you know, it's not, it's not that you can just shoot and move on. Yeah, obviously you can shoot and move on. But marking up a bunch of people, and pressing the button and being like, ba-boom, ba boom ba boom ba boom ba boom that's satisfying. Want to deal with this, would you? Yes, but how? Dynamite, obviously. What about that cannon? Okay. Or that. We're through. Let's go. Or that. set up at the river down here. You lead the way, man. I will follow. on our horses we have to get rid of them Arthur you deal with them I'll get the boats ready uh, come on get in here oh, thank you friend uh, that's how you want to do it this is where you die uh, 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 get in the other canoe and let's go Arthur but I don't want to leave my horse Being shot at still, y'all. That ain't my plan. Careful, the current's strong. Look out on the shore. They're coming after us. I'm gonna kill you myself. Are you all right? 
Oh, oh. Give me a gun. I can help. Just keep your head down. On your right, Arthur. I'm trying to Look pull. Out. Nope, I can't seem to pull out guns. All right, screw it. I guess we're just canoeing our way out of here. We need to get as far away from the fort as possible. Look right. Oh, the current should help. I don't know if my health will hang on, but. Oh my God! Now, please leave Arthur's health alone. About to be dead <laughs> otherwise. The water should be calmer ahead. We just need to keep going. Ah, no, I'm wrong. Two more on the left. Don't kill their horses. We could use them to ride out of oh, here. Oh man, that my health yeah, core got hit them. there. Let's get over to <sighs> That was almost real bad. I think we lost them. Come on. You okay, Arthur? Yeah, I'm right as rain. How are you? <clears throat> I'll be fine in a day or so. I heal fast. Colonel Favors won't be too happy with your rescue. I guess not. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot more trouble. My father. Even he may have to fight. You won't win. No big fight with them. Shouldn't y'all just run away? Where would we go? I don't know. I'm fine. Let me take you back to your father. Hmm? Thank you. No mention. Yeah. King's son. And well, I wanted to check what I would have needed for. The headshot every soldier blocking your way to Eagle Flies. Ah, and then kill enemies while escaping in the canoe. I mean, the first time I tried to pull out the pistols, it didn't even work, so obviously we lost that one. I have unopened mail. Great. And Dutch has a mission for us. And we are near Valentine. Shows mission preview. Not. Well, anyway, uh, we're going to wrap this one up here, considering that I am right on by Valentine. Valentine has a station? Has a stagecoach. So we're going to make our way on over there. And then we'll use the stagecoach to get on over to Annie'sburg and from Annie'sburg obviously we can just shoot right back on over to camp so anyway thanks for coming on by make sure to swing on back over tonight and we'll catch you guys with the second episode of the day which will probably involve Dutch and probably some shit going down